Hey guys, what is going on? I thought I'd do a quick video uh, letting you guys know and detailing the new emotes that are coming to PUBG. Um, they are currently available on the test server and we're going to have a quick look. It's not going to be a long video, it's going to be about 3 minutes long. We're going to have a quick look at the emotes and what they are and just a quick discussion about every single one of them. Uh, it won't be very long at all, but the first one we have is Go. Now of course this is very useful. Um, if you're playing in a squad or duos and they have no mic, you can use this to tell them, okay, we need to move out. Um, there's also the typical hello which is a good uh, icebreaker I guess um, you've also got thanks which is good if you're like uh, trying to communicate with teammates and tell them thank you or something like that um, you've also got affirmative so if they're asking do you want to go or yes no um, then you can say yes or no that sort of thing you've got clap um, which actually makes no sound and is a bit creepy uh, it's similar to laugh as well this doesn't make any sound either and it's just someone opening their mouth and pretending to laugh which is really really weird um, at the bottom you've got surrender now this one makes me laugh a bit because I do want to try it out with enemies and see what their reaction is they might just be like sure go or you know they might just laugh and then kill me you've also got rage here which um, is good if, if your team make a silly mistake or they start engaging when they're not supposed to you could just rage to show that you're not happy with what they've done you've got you're done here which is kind of like a just a you're done emo I guess you've also got no uh, which is useful because currently you've got go uh, yes no and you've got surrender and these are on of course your typical up down left right um, uh, key binds which is pretty pretty useful It is probably the most useful uh, emotes you're gonna get so I think that's a good idea to have him in the most uh, relevant and easy easily accessible places um, besides that you've just got the typical you know hello thank you uh, come here which I think is really really good it helps it helps elaborate and communicate with players who don't have mics of course it's not completely vocalized ie you can't say where someone is or oh, you've spotted someone southeast but I think it's better than nothing because at least this way you can have some form of communication um, which should be really really useful and helpful personally I was slightly skeptical of the addition of emotes into the game I thought it would be a fun addition but I wasn't sure how they would take it but I think um, the way they're pushing emotes is quite useful. It is quite um, relevant and useful actually. It's not like Fortnite where you've just got dances or the worm or you know the floss and it's just dancing and just fun and uh, goofiness. It's actually useful and it actually does help in the game. So you've got go come here, yes, no. These are all um, actions which you can use to communicate with teammates and hopefully get you that chicken dinner. I do hope that they um, bring a more enhanced and elaborative system I'm not sure what else they could put in but if they made it a bit more complex and they allowed you to say it's spotted or you know someone's been spotted or um, it, directions that would also be very useful so hopefully they do manage to build on that as well but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video showing you the new email system if you guys liked the video then please make sure to like it and of course subscribe for more videos I'll see you guys in the next one take care